all you've got to learn, isn't it? And hats. Yep. What about you? What is your weapon of choice right now? Ooh, the bronze scrap. Maybe, I don't know what we're learning with you. We still need to learn from the halberd. And amphibole, spear, to man, nope. Trident? Yeah. I'm gonna have a look at everyone's other equipment too. That's nearly upgraded though. So I think it'll be the Phelps Bar Belt, won't it? Now, what do I want? Go with that one. Oh, you're also nearly done with that. Charm? It's like four different things that you need. Hmm. Probably that one next then. I'm nearly done with that one. You've got a few as well. Have you used the steam chain? I'm pendant done. Calcite done. Stream chain. Or express or feldspar. What has got less on it? Maybe the stream chain. Burner slow. Hmm. Can use that one then. Your earrings. <laughs> Everyone needs silver. Oh no. Everyone. Why must you do this to me, game? Hey, shops reached level seven. Received colorful waistcoat, colorful garment woven with various materials that's surprisingly functional. Armors, uh, okay, oh no, we're silver, what? Yeah, it's that one. Now what you're wearing. Do I want to increase them? Friends and Veil. Um I'm gonna increase that one. Okay. Hmm. 
Rings. So got new ones. A lot of feldspar. Unfortunately. I don't know how to successfully quick step in this game. I think it's the, the blocking and then you move to left or right to like dodge them. But I always mistime it. Okay, we've done some upgrading. Good. Uh, favorite customer. New title. Take a look at this. So, Tipo Island. We have. Oh, we did not do too well there. Pirate flag. Atlas crew. And a new attachment. Ooh, devil wings. <gasps> devil wings. So I've got. Okay, three things there. Two there. One there. One there, two there, one. I'm gonna try and get some. Some of these done. Show them how some I of the, the lesser areas for expedition. Do a little increase on. Or try to do some increase on. I ain't, I ain't confident how this went. It's raining. Shouldn't you find shelter? Hmm. Yeah, it rains a lot here in Stonebury. It's a seasonal thing. It's good for a crop zone. It reminds us that we have to do whatever we can do each day. If you stop working because of a bit of rain, you'll never get a new town built. Do what you can each day. Exactly. We only have a limited time in which to live. Try not to leave any regrets behind, kid. Gonna go back up and see the dragon. Well, maybe see a dragon? I think. Mm -hmm. Who are you? Oh, dragon's nest is in the mountains above, the hills and the plains. Scaly beast only returns there on rainy days. In fact, a dragon might even be the source of the storms. Thanks for information. In any case, that means if we go there now, chances are it'll be home. Oh, we've got devil. <gasps> hey there. Our meeting like this must be Providence Meow. Cats? We're in a hurry. Cats? Save it, cats. All the better, Meow. I've just stumbled upon a perfectly nifty piece of stone just for you. Oh. What's it for? Teleporting. Teleporting. <gasps> Is it? Is it the hell port? Fast travel? Bingo! I dug it out of some ruins, meow. <gasps> you got a fish tail! Meow me years ago for surfing along earth pulses, but I can't use it, so I figured I'd pawn it off on someone else who could, meow. Wait, surfing along earth pulses? Wait, Norman made this? That doesn't exactly inspire confidence. Don't be so mean! We're capable of exceptional things! Sometimes, when a Norman speaks their own name, the board springs to life! Whisks its masters away at top speed. They'll even plow right through weak demons. You can say it's our masterwork, even if what you, Wait, what do you mean? Huh. Well, then I Play through weak demons. So we can ride this as long as we have Genfu with us, right? Well, 
Kind of. Do you have to use your true name to activate it? Not my true name, no. My Norman name. Wouldn't that just be Bienfu? No. Norman have a separate name that goes something like Norman so and so. It's almost more a Norman so and so? Often the name has something to do with what they're good at. Something like attack or chain or aqua. Right. You could say names like Bienfu and Grimoire are more like stage names. Okay. I actually don't know Bienfu's Norman name, but I can't wait to find out. What is your name, Bienfu? Uh, come on out. Oh with no. It. We're in a hurry. Norman Brave. Whoa, look at that! Wait, Bienfu. <laughs> your Norman name is Brave? <laughs> that is so deliciously absurd! Why do you think I've never told you before, Herbie? <laughs> at least the board works now. And if we get on this board, it'll move us around. <laughs> Wait, what? Well, about that. The board propels itself by pushing against Earth Pulse flows. To do that, the board needs information on the flows. But this one here's a completely blank slate, Meow. First, you need to find the geo trees in each area. They serve as a conduit between the surface land and the Earth Pulses, Meow. Once you've actually located a geo tree, you can record that area's Earth Pulse data into your geo board, Meow. Got it. This area's geo tree is right over there, Meow. All right then. That's not so a long tree. As we find more geo trees. We'll be able to use the geo. Hey, enough he's trying for tonight. We have to spend a minute more in Cory when he starts sobbing. Oh. Uh, we kind of open the boards. I know we're gonna have to stack like skyscraper. Wait, wait. This, this, is awful. Because, wait, you've made me pass through all of these fucking areas that I've gotten locked. All the ones that have a picture next to them. And now, now, now you give me the... Oh. <laughs> Bastards. Are you gonna make me fight for this as well, are you? I think it might be a sort of fast travel. But the issue is, if it's a blank slate, I need to go back to all the areas I've been for. <laughs> Ooh, hi. At least that, that's the impression I got. Ooh, was it a Shrike dive? Belt earrings. Okay, you can ride a geoboard by holding- <gasps> That's how we get over gaps? Is it? Okay. Uh, holding R2, geoboards allow you to move faster than usual as well as travel on Previously inaccessible paths. However, you'll need to unlock each area's geo tree before you can ride a board there. Uh, while riding a geoboard, you can defeat enemies under a certain level without starting an encounter just by touching them. However, you will not be rewarded with XP or gold by doing so. You can start encounters while on a geoboard by using a dark bottle. Is it faster? This is well, not fast travel at all, is it? Handy. Yeah, and it's a lot of fun to ride too. I thought it was a fast travel. It's just a slightly faster uh, mode so of walking. I feel like I had to sprint the whole way here. Huh. Seems like operating the board saps a lot of energy from BN for It's even worse. Even still, this board gives us a strategic advantage. Brave here will just have to bear a little exertion now and then. Yeah, brave. Buck up. I believe in you. Be brave. Ah, stop calling me that! <laughs> 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 
Wait, so... Can I do anything? No. Where am I going anyway? I want to go to... Where am I going? Mountain Peaks, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, oh. This is weird. Oh god, I, I don't, oh, don't like this. I'm just surfing with my cat on my head. I, oh my god, I'm missing these as well now. No! I have lost the ability to hit things. Oh, wow, I went in a circle. Which way am I going? <laughs> I don't like the camera. Hey, no we don't. There we go, there we go, there we go, yeah. Doing it, doing it, doing it. I feel like I'm doing some Tony Hawks shit right here. I am faster than them though. Nice. Oh crap, dismissing everything. He went right into the. Oh, this is not good. Hit it, hit it. Everything you got. Okay then. Soul Taker. Doom, doom. Whoa, God. <laughs> this is. This is um, my, my least favorite thing right now. It will make some things a bit quicker though. If it's what I think it is, I, I might be able to leap over gaps and get to areas I haven't been before. <laughs> yeah, I'm making a skateboard. <laughs> Climb up these vines. This might be a tough encounter. <gasps> it's a dragon. Oh, you don't look so hot. I'm looking at your ass, aren't I? It looks so deadly. And just check out how much malevolence it's putting out. Which means it's not a theory. Get a cute little cat. Let's retreat. It does look We've a bit no reason dead, to doesn't it? It's something we can't handle. I do. Eisen? No. No. Oh, you're up for it? What? What are you doing? She's right. Fighting this creature is a good way to end up dead. Shh. Eleanor. Oh, uh, sorry. Oh, no gone done it. This could be a tough one. Ooh, Shenlong. Okay, you are uh, Dragon Winged. You're level 62. I am not. I am, what, 40? If that? Right, so uh, Light and Fire. Dragon Winged. Yeah, ready to die. 
Just skateboard away. Yeah, we should. Oh, you stunned us. Am I, like, supposed to be able to deal with this or not? Oh, we're do okay, so it's taking part in it and going cutscene on it. Yeah. This one definitely puts up a better fight than your average demon. Is there any hope of actually defeating this thing? I'll do whatever it takes. That's my way. Sabine! Dudes, don't get in our way. We're trying to get all these dudes. Yeah. I see you're out for blood, as usual. I think his hair goes from like, you know, a silver to a the green at the the ends. He just took the full brunt of that punch, didn't he? Out of my way. It is Zavid. We've dealt with him before. He had the what? gun. Are you protecting the dragon? She's not a dragon. Off, or I'll make that gun off. can bring out people's powers and turn them back into I think they're human forms or really Damn, it got away. I've seen them a couple of times that hurts babe and here we hadn't seen each other in so long. <laughs> for so nice yeah Is that dragon someone you knew? I told you, she's not a Oh, dragon. don't call her dragon. Okay. So, it seems old check out my pecs and the dragon have some kind of close ties. Did I hear you right? We're talking about a dragon here. I know what I said. Uh, but how Mr. Check out my bags. When Malakim are tainted by malevolence, a dragon is what ultimately results. So you're saying that dragon was a Malak Zavid once knew? She must be who he was praying for back in town. Okay. Yeah, most likely. But do Malakim put out malevolence like humans do? No. Not by themselves, they don't. But if one remains in contact with humans or demons who do, it will eventually taint her, and she will become a dragon. What about you, kiddo? Okay. You feel anything weird after you got thrown into the Earth Pulse at the Empyrean's throne? I did, yeah. Can't say I'm surprised. The air there was thick with malevolence being sent on its way to Enominat. If I'd stayed there, I might be a dragon too. Is having a vessel not enough to prevent a Moloch from transforming? A vessel can reduce the effect, but not eliminate it. By stripping their Malachim of consciousness, the Abbey exorcists seem to be able to inhibit the transformation. But nothing Ooh, in this world okay. is guaranteed. Can a dragon ever be changed back into a Moloch? Nope. Just like with demons, there's no going back. Do they still hold on to some sort of highlight that area? You saw that dragon. Anime? What do you think? Well, that's... But Zavid still won't kill it. Must be his creed at work. Aizen, listen. Whatever business you and Zavid have with that dragon, I don't care. Do what you have to. But I won't tolerate you getting the rest of us involved in it again. Do I make myself clear? Yeah, Aizen is a bit of a wild card. Good. Now, let's get back to the Therian hunt. He isn't really with us with us. We'll like, in Titania. for the party. He goes and does his own thing from time to time. Runs off. If what Aizen said is true, then could I wind up as a dragon someday? Or Aizen too? It would be cool to be a dragon. I don't know. Now where am I going? I uh, return to Titania. Wow, okay. Okay. 
Or I forget, I've got my hoverboard. Isn't the Malik? Yeah. Where do I want to go? Do do. Where's that about? Um, that is not near here. Lafazette wants to go there. You know what? I'm going to go and explore the other two areas. There's a map here. <laughs> there's a map here. No, there's a cave up there. And a cave down there. Yes, yeah, so we're going to we're going to go exploring. Screw it. Oh god, I don't know how bored. I don't know how to use this. I was vessel. Um. Well, it's strange. He kept referring to the coin that he has as his vessel, and that the ship used to be his vessel as well. So I don't know if they, how he's not tied to a, a person or a living being. But the coin is the coin that he can never get. Um, is it heads up? I can't remember which way around. Because he's got the reaper's curse. So I don't know if being a reaper means it's slightly different for him. <laughs> yeah, because the oh, I can't see what I'm doing with this angle. I've just gone past where I want to go, don't I? Ah, the sheer panic. Anyways, just flying next to me. Let's go, Louis. Let's go up here. Do a little bit of exploration, maybe some side quest stuff. Do, do, do. I actually do want this. <laughs> but I do wonder if we will eventually get certain outfits. There's um I haven't put it on. That's the wrong menu. Fashion. Oh, G G G word. There's a spin there. We've got the swimwear edition. I think Roku was the only one. And I love that because I've got the adornment on, which is the rose. It is stabbing him. It is stabbing him. He has been stabbed. In jest. I am Rose. There's no other way that's staying on. Not a chance. But yeah, I still always have their um, the swimwear outfits. I'm sure in Tales of Vesperia they had it as well. And it was the main character, Yuri, the one you controlled. I'm sure he had like a Hawaiian shirt type deal and shorts. So my characters looked a little bit of a state in the previous game as well. Oh, I haven't found the thing I need. Can't get through there. Per Roku to a kiss from a rose on the grave. <laughs> <laughs> oh, brilliant. Ooh, what's that noise? What is that? What can I do here? It's... Is this danger gas? <laughs> danger gas. Whatever danger gas is, this is what we've got. <laughs> 